Hey, reader friends, this is Mrs. Olson again, and I have another wonderful story to share with you today. Um, depending on which story you've listened to first, I am having trouble talking a little bit again today, so I am letting a guest reader read our stories for us today. But let me tell you about this book. This is a new book, and the title is I Am Every Good Thing. It is written by Derek Barnes, who also wrote Crown, an Ode to the Fresh Cut, which we have in our library. Look at all of these awards that it's won. And um, Gordon C. James is the illustrator of both of these books. And you will be amazed at his illustrations. They look they look so real, but you can see the beautiful brush strokes and the colors. He is such an amazing artist. So you're really going to enjoy that. Um, Mr. Barnes also wrote The King of Kindergarten, which we read back in August, but there was a different illustrator of that book. So same author on all three books, same illustrators on these two. All right, um, the copyright date I think I mentioned was 2020. This is a pretty new book, and it was published by Nancy Paulson Books, which is part of Penguin Books. All right, Miss Olson is going to switch over to my Audible account, and I am going to let the pros read it for you today so you don't have to listen to my old scratchy voice. I hope you enjoy this beautiful story. Um, the theme of this story is being positive. We all have times when um, people make us feel bad or maybe we've made a mistake and we feel down on ourselves, but I am every good thing reminds us to tell each other and tell ourselves good positive things that help us understand who we really are. All right, here we go, guys. Every Good Thing by Derek Barnes, illustrated by Gordon C. James, read for you by Joshua David Scarlett. To Tamir Rice, Trayvon Martin, E.J. Bradford, Jordan Edwards, Michael Brown, Jordan Davis, and Julian Mallory, DB. To my son, Gabriel, and all little brothers like him, GCJ. I am a nonstop ball of energy, powerful and full of light. I am a go-getter, a difference maker, a leader. I am every good thing that makes the world go round. You know, like gravity or the glow of moonbeams over a field of brand new snow. I am good to the core, like the center of a cinnamon roll. Yeah, that good. I am skateboard tricks, scraped knees and elbows. But you know what? I am right back on my feet again. I am one eye open, one eye closed peeking through a microscope, gazing through a telescope, checking out the spaces around me and plotting out those far off places I have yet to go, but will. I am a gentleman and a scholar. I am kind and polite, like yes ma'am and yes sir, helping my grandmother cross the street and saying bless you when a stranger has to sneeze. I'm a cool breeze. A perfect paper airplane that glides for blocks, for miles, forever. I am a roaring flame of creativity. I am a lightning round of questions and a star-filled sky of solutions. I am an explorer, planting a flag on every square foot of this planet where I belong. I'm a sponge, soaking up information, knowledge, and wisdom. I want it all, and I am all ears. I am Saturday mornings in the summertime. I am two bounces and a front flip off the diving board. I am hilarious. I am the life of the party. I am that smile forming on your face right now. I'm the boom bap, boom boom bap, when the bass line thumps and the kick drum jumps. I'm the perfect beat, the perfect rhyme, keeping everything on point and always on time. But you already knew that. I am a grand slam. Bass is fully loaded. I'm a nasty two-handed dunk, holding on to the rim just to remind you that I'm still the man. Believe that. 
I am the undisputed champion. I am a highlight reel of magnificence. I am the celebration, the applause, and the standing ovation. I am victory. I am a brother, a son, a nephew, a favorite cousin, a grandson. I am a friend. I am real. I am tight hugs, a hand to hold, a shoulder to cry on. If you have to, I hope you never have to. I am here. Although I am something like a superhero, every now and then, I am afraid. I am not what they might call me, and I will not answer to any name that is not my own. I am what I say I am. I am that sound in the forest when the mighty tree falls. I am waves crashing gently on the shore. I am a force of nature, a miracle, a blessing. I am brave. I am hope. I am my ancestors' wildest dream. I am worthy of success, of respect, of safety, of kindness, of happiness. And without a shadow of a doubt, I am worthy to be loved. I am worthy to be loved. Wasn't that a wonderful story, boys and girls? And so true. Each of you listening, you are precious. You are worthy to be loved. And we do love you here at Woodrow Cummins. We are so thankful for each of your precious little lives. All right. I hope that story made you feel warm and happy inside. Anytime that you're feeling sad, you remember all of those good things and you tell those things to yourself. And I will too when I get down. All right, boys and girls, I think we've got one more story to go.